Yeah, I think especially after last week, we were able to come out um, with a different attitude um, individually as well as collectively. And, you know, it's no easy task playing against the defending champions, but the game could have gone either way. Um, so this is kind of this is what we have to bring and we have to bring more and more. This is the game we have to build off, you know. So I think I think it was much better than last week and we got to keep going. Uh, Kevin just said that today is a game that can give you personally confidence um, after everything that you've been through over the last 18 months or so since, since your mm -hmm. injury. Do you feel that way? Is this a performance that you can personally build off as well? Yeah, of course. I think uh, as a goalkeeper coming in the first part of the season, you definitely want to build off different pieces of performances in different games. And 100% a clean sheet, a good home performance is something I can build off and keep going into the rest of the season. One more for me. This is obviously a big game for you personally with uh, your family in the stands. How does it feel to uh, yeah. have them here today? It feels really cool. Yeah, having my whole family here, getting to watch. Um, when I was in the academy, they used to come and we would watch uh, the White Caps and the first team play before. And it was, it was like, for me as a, as a young player, it was a huge spectacle for myself. So having them come and go from sitting in the stands, watching it with me, to now being in the stands and getting to watch me is it's a dream come true. Um, it is. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I, I was just really curious about that stop that you made at mm -hmm. the very end. Um, just walk us through that, because that was probably one of the most spectacular moments of the entire game. Yeah, um, thinking back to it now, uh, I just remember the ball coming in from wide whipped across off his foot and then just watching, seeing my position, watching it come off and then watching the ball the entire time, getting a hand to it. Um, and yeah, it was a big moment. It definitely helped us in the game. At the same time, second half, I think that was their only one big chance. So um, it's what I'm there to do. And same time, it's huge credit to the guys in front of me because I had one shot in the second half. And then, yeah, hardest part is the goalkeeper is making that one save. But again, it was one. So a lot of credit to the guys in front of me. Mm -hmm. The most difficult games are the ones where you're not testing a lot. 100%. Like the one today, and then 100%. you have to come up with a stuff like that. When you, when you, like, without saying that last, last week was any of your fault, because I, don't, I personally don't think it was, but it was a, mm -hmm. a song criticism from the likes of TSN. Um, mm -hmm. How important then is it to come up with a performance like yours today to sort of shut down the critiques, tell people, like, yeah. oh, I can't play this before, I can't be the number one? Yeah, 100%. And yeah, 100%. And um, at the same time, the most important thing is for myself personally, you know, after four goals last weekend, no matter what anybody says, you know, I'm the first person to look at myself and say, hey, individually, what can I do better? As a team, what can we do better? So more than it's shutting up critics anywhere else, it's, it's my personal, you know, what I want to set up and achieve. I look at it and I go, I need to be better. I need to do this. I need to do that. So as great as it is saying, hey, I can replace him. I can be here. I can do this. Looking at it from my point of view is just, okay, I did better. What can we build off? What can we do more? You know, um, all that stuff is kind of outside noise and I try and keep it that way. It's just a personal for myself to say, okay, I need to help the team. I need to be better. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Hi, Tom. Just want your thoughts on your defenders in front of you, particularly Flory and Youngward. Yeah, those guys were beasts today. Um, flow, a number of tackles, a number of balls coming through, heading it away. Um, on the ball, um, Flo is fantastic, you know, he brings so much energy to us, um, he's a great leader out there, he communicates very well, and he's always up for the game no matter what, and he's there for the guys around him, it's a huge, huge help to the team, but at the same time, you know, Ranko was great, I think even last game, was tough as a center back, but he was great today, and he was solid, again, being the one in the middle, won tons of balls, and then Tristan on my right, fantastic. I can't. I don't even know how many tackles he had. He had one in the second half, sliding tackle. Um, that, that's as important as my save, you know. So they were they were fantastic today, and as much as I helped them clean sheet, they were they were a massive massive part of it, just like the rest of the team.